It's the maiden voyage of the Kokido 200 rechargeable cordless leaf bag. It's got a 7 foot pole, a 30 minute runtime, and a flotation device for its leaf bag. Welcome to Eclectic Ideas. Let's see what's in the box. Here's a section pole that extends to the length you need it. Here's a small but mighty 1.5 pound unit. It has a short streamlined water path for super concentrated suction power. This is the vacuum bag with foam. This is the charging cable, the handle adapter, and this vacuum platen accepts debris up to three inches. And perhaps you can see a notch right here. And that, I'm gonna point to it with this plier. That notch is going to match up with this notch right here. And we're just gonna click it in. And when it's clicked in, you'll, you should hear a snap. Um, let's try it. And it's kind of looking like a SpaceX rocket, right? Like it's a rocket ship to the moon. So now we've got the unit assembled. Let's go ahead and flip it upside down. And we can see this wide mouth that accepts up to three inches worth of leaf debris, the wheels and the bristle brushes that help you clean. Now let's rotate the unit around back so that we can see where we're gonna grab that pole handle attachment. This clip is a very stubborn one. You have to depress those two sides in and get it under that through that pit hole. It took stronger fingers than I had, and when you get that done, it pops in easily. So now we're just going to take this right here, turn it this way, and just put it over these two holes, and we're going to pin it back in. I was afraid this was going to be hard, but that's a breeze. It just pops right in. Getting it out is the only hard part. That handle attachment accepts a universal pull, too, if you have one. The instructions show step three to put the debris bag on, but first, let's look under this silicon cover, and you'll see you're charging for it right here. And one unit is square, one is arched, and so that shows you how to easily put in your cord or your plug right there. It's very simple to do. And this will go ahead and go into your adapter, and you just plug it in to charge it. Very easy. Now let's take that out, and I'll show you just with the power brick. See, it doesn't have a full charge, and that's your indicator that you need to go ahead and charge your vacuum. Let's take out the charging cord, and. See all these little metal pieces in here? We just want to be sure that silicon flap is securely in place so that none of those rust on us, and that'll keep that from happening right there. Right under the silicon flap is a magnetic switch that ensures the motor is completely sealed and waterproof. Let's turn it on. And that's the power you've got under the hood to pick up all that debris in your pool. And it does it quickly and efficiently, is what we're told. We're going to find out as soon as we Pop the t-shirt on this little guy. He's got to be fully dressed before he goes to work, just like the rest of us, right? We're going to cinch this little drawstring cord in right here. And at the top of his t-shirt is a foam floater that ensures that that bag stays up at all times. Now let's turn it on through the bag. That's what you're going to have to do when you get to the pool. And we're going to go ahead right now and twist the included pole that comes with the unit. We're just going to twist that into the handle we've already attached. This part right here is the part I was telling you will accept a universal pole if you already have one. Now you can make this pole any length you need for your pool. Just go ahead and snap these in. I didn't do it in the studio because it was too long. And here we go. We're back to the front of the video where the maiden voyage happens and we're going to suck the debris out. And I was actually very impressed with the job it does to be so small. It really picks up the leaves nicely. It's so lightweight that as it gets longer, you do have to navigate the pole a little bit to hold it down in the water because it tends to float. The quickness of this lightweight vacuum more than makes up for that. I like the Kokido leaf vacuums a lot. They do a quick, satisfying run over the pool. And if your back is bad, this lightweight feature could really help out because it doesn't put additional strain on it. And that little styrofoam float right there really keeps it up so that the, the bag fills up nicely and doesn't get in your way. And let's pull it out and see how much stuff it got out and it's gonna be you just pop this off just turn it with your hand and get this out it's very compact very lightweight you get a 30 minute runtime and you get a husky a husky helping you do this may or may not be a good thing but <laughs> the pole this was a nice feature because the pole is so long I could just lean it up against the wall and totally free up my hands to rinse out the bag and the unit the Kokido ExtraVac 200 is a great leaf vacuum. You're going to love it, I think. I love it. Welcome to pool season. Thanks for watching.